Hello guys, Lee the DVD collector here, and to now everyone is waiting for scene part 2. But here it is, part 2 of my TMNT DVD collection, stands for Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. So the last left off, I show you the season 3 collections on the first part. Now let's continue the rest. So after those crazy madness volumes for volumes 1, the volumes 3 through 6, which is also season 3, Lionsgate was decided they released some season sets, starting off with season 4. And I'm sorry about the um, the darkness of me because um, because the the window there it's very bright you couldn't even see me but you can see me but you can't even see me in the dark but when I show this in the back of the light you could see me. So anyways, here is season four. It came with a really nice slip cover. It's not like those Simpsons heads, it's got like the crusty head version like I had in season eleven from when I showed you in my Simpsons DVD collection. Yeah, it came with a slip cover. When I got it from Amazon, I was so lucky. I I have the original slip cover, but I have to say, good luck finding the slip cover because even though the slip cover is very hard to find, but it's very easy if you buy it on the internet or you can find it in, in in your U.S. local Walmart, Best Buy, or Target. Not sure Walmart does have it because I ne I know. I'm not living in the US, I live in the UK, so I just got the DVDs um, from the Amazon UK website. <clears throat> so here's season 4, came out of the plastic box, and even though the plastic box wasn't shut because one of those tabs there has snapped off, so I was impressed about that. But overall, this is the um, King of the slipcover, really nice slipcover Raphael here, there's Ralph's face. Really embossed. And so is the logo. Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles original logo is embossed as well. And it's the first time this one has special features. All the rest of the DVDs were bare bones. It's just episodes. And season four does have underneath the shell slash the evil turtle. The shred inside the most turtles must be as a foe. And fresh from the oven, a recipe for a carbonga cheese pizza fit for a ninja turtle. There's full screen 2.0 audio tracks. Yeah, and the documentary for for Shredder, <laughs> I think everybody knows this, is, I think, James Avery, who is the voice of Shredder, who's also played Uncle Phil from The Fresh Prince of Bel Air. <laughs> yeah, that's, that's what a lot of people know this about it. The exact same thing is what came out of the slipcover. Oops. So open it and you see there's a disc. You see there's disc one, two, three, four, and five. If you notice on disc five, Splinters, look, he doesn't look like that. There, he looks like from the original. It's not sorry. He wasn't look like it from from the original series. He's he looks like from the 2003 series. I don't know why he has that look. I just don't understand. Yeah, as you can see tab here, it's snapped off. I'm not sure where the other one is. Yeah, I'm not going to plan not to get that one again because because I already do have, if I do have another one, it won't keep the slip cover. But I was not impressed if it, when this, why this happened with the tab thing. I wasn't impressed about that. I put the tab back in. Yeah, see, lid wasn't shut properly, it just keeps open. Yeah, see, it's open. It never shuts properly. So, anyways, that's season four. Came with this really nice slip cover. But good luck finding season four, by the way. And now, next one, season five. And this is not the older season five. This is a newer version of season five, which came with a DVD size packaging. Now, originally, season five came out as a very special thing. It usually came out as a pizza box version. I think everybody has that one, but I'm the only one who do not have the original co original cardboard season five um, pizza box. It usually came out with a digi pack inside, but I was not planning not to get the pizza box version simply because 
This one is re-released to there and they slimmed it down. It's much fair in your shelf spaces, just to prefer. But I really love to get that pizza box version, just to add to the collection, but I was not planning not to. So that's season five in a re-release style. This one's re-released in 2014. That one's got re-released. And then he got season six. And season six came with a slip cut no sorry. Came with this really nice um uh comic book style. Yeah, it's like total exploding in the page. Yeah. And this is not the actual US release. This is the um Canadian version, as you can see. It says this is from Canadian. If you can't see it, I'm sorry if the picture's a bit blurry actually. I think some of my videos are a bit blurry sometimes, but I'm very sorry about that. <clears throat> I do try my best to get this high def as best as we can, best as I can. Yeah, yeah, I got the Canadian version of season six. Didn't have the actual U.S. version. Yeah, it says Maple on there. It's a Canadian name for the Ninja Turtles. Yeah, that's season six. And also to mention. Season 5 and 6 were released in a double feature pack set. Um, if, you, if you're wondering, all these volumes and the season sets were released in a double pack versions. So, if you do have the uh, original versions, don't pick up the double feature versions. If you've got double feature, don't pick up the sets. But... I'm sorry here to tell you that the two pack versions were available as well. I'm not sure they're a Walmart exclusive or you can find it in any store. So anyways, back to the um, DVD collection. Then, <clears throat> in 2009, celebrating the 25th anniversary of the Turtles, they re released Season 7, but this time they put out as a four part, four volumes. So, and each volume came with an action figure inside. So, I only have three of season seven. I have the um, a whole collection of season seven as well. So here we got um, the Michelangelo slice, and whoops, and it's the only one I didn't have an action figure inside. It's a bit disappointing. I got this off of Amazon, um, not not back in last year. Um, I also have Leonardo Slice, but unfortunately, the Leonardo Slice, which I first got, it didn't come with a original um, toy inside, but, um, yeah, when I first got Leonardo Slice, I think I mentioned this on my Region 1 DVD collection, the Leonardo Slice, um, which I first got, didn't came with a slipcover, I think I already said that, um, and then and the disc itself, I'm using Michelangelo Slice as an example, the disc holder for this has cracked, has cracked. So, so that's why it's a good job I have the Amazon paper receipt to be able to return it. Then, my, then when the Michelangelo slice came, and we didn't have the receipt to take it back, which is very stupid. But oh well, I I kept the one, so yeah, it's just added to the collection now. So now. And guess what? I'm I haven't got the Donato and Raphael slice in a DVD form like Michelangelo slice. Where it did go off Amazon, which I'm so happy they put them in the action figure form. <laughs> yeah, this the um came with a sealed bag inside. I haven't opened it. I'm just keeping it sealed. So because because I'm a collector, so I can keep things inside. I haven't took it out to look at it, so that's why I haven't a chance to have a look at the toy. Yeah, this one's really nice, and it also mentioned, if you put all these together, it makes a big mural of the turtles leaving from the rooftops, tops, which is very nice. And the pictures is actually thing as the, um, the best of collection of the turtles in the UK. Let's open this up, shall we? Very nice box, actually. Very nice. So take this out. So... Here is the action figure I came with. It's done by Playmates Toys, the company did with some many TMNT toys. So I'll take this out and show you just quickly. 
So here is the closer look of Donatello, who is the who is a turtle who mi builds machines. Yeah, he's kind of like from the uh, original classic Playmates toys released in 1988. Yeah, I haven't opened it, but if I open this packaging and I can show you all of them, so I just prefer keeping this in this packaging better. Anyways, here's the actual DVD itself. And the fun facts about the exact same thing as the UK version. And then here's the episode lists. And this one has its own special features because each one of these sets came with their own special features. So, the Michelangelo slice has um, a celebration of the Turtles creation. New interviews with the Team NT creators. I think that's interviews with the Kevin Eastman and Peter Laird. And then the Don Teller slice has a celebration of the TV sensation. New interviews with the Hit Show's creative team. Very nice featurettes on these. And then there's the ad for the Team NT game, and then, then there's an ad for the um, Team NT DVD. So I'll show you this on my Michelangelo DVD. Yeah, very nice. If you want to get a hold of this, you can definitely grab it. Very nice release. So we're going to put this back in. There you go, all nice and set. And then, here's the Raphael slice. Same thing as Donatello's, this one has the action figure came with it. So I'm going to open this. Take a DVD and a toy as well. Here's the action figure. Same thing as Donnie's, I kept him in a sealed bag. So if you can't see him that properly. But here's a closer look at Raph. He's my favorite Ninja Turtle. I noticed his size is a bit bent. Well, that's what the sculpture is. The weapons themselves are not removable. They are sculpted in their hands. So let me put in the collector's item. And then here is the DVD itself. Season 7. And the special features on these, it has a celebration of phenomenon sensation, defoed by diehard Team NT fans speak. And it's just got the fans documentary on it as well. And the, the bonus features on this were the sexy thing as the Calabonga Classics one. Um, let's get back in. There we go, all set. That's Raphael Slice. But now here's the um, Season 7 collection. Yeah, this one I don't have the Leonardo Slice, the King of the Action figure. But the Leonardo Slice has um, a celebration of post articulation, a look back at the most fantastic toys, which is the introduction of the um, Team NT toys that put out throughout the years. And then all special features were already read, read on these volume sets. So here's the discs, here's Leonardo Slice, Mike, the Michelangelo Slice, Donatello Slice, and the Raphael Slice. Yeah, if you want to get all these um, volumes, that's fine. But just to, men just to mention, all these versions were reprints, and they're very expensive to get them. But if you want to prefer this, you can definitely grab it. It's much more better than your shelf spaces. <clears throat> now, here's the complete Season 8. They finally got it right. They made it as a complete format as well. But it's a shame the episodes were a bit shorter because it's only eight episodes. I've never seen most kid mo most kids shows only have that many of the run. And also to know, seasons eight through ten are the Red Sky version. It's because there's a different intro of it. But there is season nine. And season nine which I remember, it came with a slipcover, which is like a 3D lenticular version. I don't have that one. Yeah. 